Good afternoon, and today at New York City Transit, we're going to show you the engine and chassis wash. Before going with that, I'm going to show you the wand that we use to spray. There's a handle back here that you pull back. It's under a reasonable amount of pressure, so you really should use two hands. You'll notice that once I pull the trigger, the water may come out somewhat slow, but it will build up. The machine is, the steam jenny is on a need to know or need to use basis. So we'll start with that. This handle here is also like a throttle, allowing more or less pressure. And I will demonstrate that once we get the water coming through the nozzle. Low. Now it builds up. This is under high pressure. We can now throttle down the pressure if we're going over things such as like electrical cables and things like that. We do not need to wash them under extreme pressure, all right? But when we are washing like the chassis, the engines, the axles, the transmissions, we do need to turn the pressure up. This way we can do a proper cleaning job. Now I'm going to walk to the front. We're going to start by washing the tanks in the area up above the axle and then we're going to wash the forward part of the axle from one brake across the suspension, across the axle to the other side with the brakes and the uh, kingpin area. We want to make sure that that is all washed properly. So with that we're going to start.
Now we will allow the chassis to drip dry a couple of two minutes and then we will wash from behind therefore washing the entire front axle parts and assembly this way it will be clean for the inspectors to do their job and be able to see if there are any uh, worn out parts while they're doing their SO inspections.